Let's look at Thiefnet now that I got all this dang old money. Fist of Flame, Temporal Lock, thank you. Uh, Feral Pounce, why not? Give me, uh, Adrenaline Burst, and I'll take Alarm Clock and Berserker Charge, just because they're cheap. Yeah, look at that, we just bought so many items. You get so much money from chips. We're also gonna get a lot of money from this next job. Whoops. Because the next job... Oh, you can actually look at the stuff from here. That's cool. But the next job gives us, uh... Not what I meant to click. I clicked the wrong button every single time for some reason. Battle on the High Seas is just doing a lot of galleon duels, and they do give you money for it as if you're doing a normal galleon duel, so... You will get a lot of money from that, and we'll probably fight a couple of ships on the way, potentially. Let me just grab this loot, and then fight you idiots. It'll be a lot easier to fight stuff now that we have these boosted, really cool-looking shark cannons. Oh, this guy's donezo. I didn't do as much as I was hoping. Look at how cool they look with the golden shark heads on them. Come on. Come on. Drop. Drop. Need that last one to drop. Gamer. Easy. Bring her around, Murray. Shoot him down from the starboard side. Oh, they quick pivoted when they saw what I was doing. Dude, the upgraded cannons are such a big difference. I love it. Makes it even easier to grind up the money. Why, hello there, doggo. Arg, matey, I be boarding your ship. Ye ship. Nope. 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 These guys block normal attacks, so I always find, uh, find it's a lot quicker to just spam the push attack on them. And then blow up their allies so they take damage from that. See how quick that goes? It's so easy to make money- uh, money? <laughs> to make money off of galleon duels. I tried to say money and galleon at the same time. That was actually less than I was expecting. We continue on to the battle on the high seas. We were at about the three hour mark. I think we're gonna end up going longer than four hours today, which is fine. But I do think we're gonna finish the game today because there's only one more episode after this one and it it's an epi it's like the final episode so it doesn't have like an overworld associated with it and whatnot. I didn't think my cannons would make it that far to be real with you. Oh dear. Their cannons made it this far as well. There we go. It's still not down. Hey, stop that. Oh, you're right next to me. Did not realize this one was right next to me. Yeah, shoot at him. I was really hoping that would kill you. But anyways, yeah, I think we will be able to finish the game today. I'll have to go a little over four hours, but that's fine. I don't, I don't think it'll even take us a full five hours, to be real with you. At least I really don't expect it to. Dude, these purple flagships are so bulky. I pressed circle there, but it didn't... I guess I wasn't close enough. I must have been slightly too far away. Ah, oh, you suck! Skill issue. There we go. You dumb pirate idiots. Look at this little chihuahua. I'm gonna end his very soul. Hello. Behold, it is I, Sly Cooper. Wait a minute. Oh, I'm still set to the treasure map. Behold, it is I, Cantankerous Tim, back from the dead. I'm a Cooper now. Nope. Aw, oh, I missed my spin. Get off my ship! I called dibs. This is mine now. See you later, sucker. Not the move I wanted to do. Aw, oh, silent obliteration! If that had killed him, that would have been so funny. A large diamond! I'm loaded. Ooh, almost 500. I'm a pickaroon! Whatever the heck that means. Is that a pun on raccoon or is Picaroon an actual word? I don't know. 
The map did not make it look like I was this close to this island, but I guess I am. Give me that health. Now I'm gonna let these ships go. Like I said, I think we'll be able to finish the game today, so, you know, I don't want to, like, ignore doing Galleon duels, because they're fun, and this is the only time in the game you get to do them, other than multiplayer, but, uh, I also don't want to take too long, you know what I mean? If I don't get a good opportunity to jump over there before one of these cannons cools down, alright, you know what, die. See you later, sucker. We'll just do a, a really quick 225 there. Yo, 6-9. 69. Nice. Whoop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Battle of the high seas, here we come. Pretty sure I'm at full health, but this will assure that I'm at full health. Should be, yeah, just up ahead. Getting close. Bum, bum. Oh dear, the slowdown. The misty effects. The PS2 didn't like this uh, episode very much either when it came to frames. But Cloud Gaming really hates it. Excellent. We've got one away from the rest of the fleet. Make sure to board the enemy vessel once their mast has fallen. We need to find out the patrol routines for the rest of the clan. With some planning, we should be able to ambush them in small groups. Two arms! Their mast is down! Ram our ship into theirs and jump onto the enemy's vessel! Every time I hit L2 to move left or right, or... It doesn't happen with R2. It's just when I hit L2. The game thinks I'm trying to use a gadget, but I'm not trying to use a gadget. I'm just moving to the left. With this red sail captain and his Maybe it's because of what I have set to L2? The combat dodge? Is that's what... What's causing it? Switch off of combat dodge to, like, feral pounce. Look at how far I can jump. Ow. Okay. There we go. Nope. Hi, welcome back. Die. Aw, oh, dang it. Alright, alright, alright. Hold up, hold up. Let's not be stupid for a second. That guy just walked off the edge and died. Like, he, he chose death. I was about to say, I... Should not have gone for silent obliteration there. I knew it was going to get me killed. Oh, I have to do the galleon bit again? Is that going to reach? Nope. The start of that... The start of that fight was really weird. I shouldn't have gone for that silent obliteration, but I was just like, go fast forehead. This is not going as smooth as it did a second ago. All right, now. Oh, it's a different enemy now. Now it'll be easier for sure. Don't talk to me. Good job, Murray. Just a second. Help. Okay. Hi. Deal with this red sail captain and his mercenary crew is sure to surrender. Surely. I really wish that it didn't try, like, I understand why it does, game mechanic-wise, but I really wish it would let me do my charge move even when an enemy was knocked down, because I just want to do my charge move. <laughs> hey, I got the red sailed charts. And a lot of money. Nice watch. Buckling Sly, I've analyzed the patrol schedule and marked the best place to attack on your sea chart. I already went by here earlier. Alright, well, we're fighting these three now. I did not hit as many as I was hoping. Oh yeah, hit him, please. Make my life easier. You're all gonna be dead by the time I'm done. Uh-oh. Help. All right, two of them have white sails. We wanna go for the white sail ones first so that the gray sail one keeps helping us. I don't even know if the gray and white ones hitting the, uh, like, the opposing ships actually counts as damage or not, if they programmed that properly. All right, you're dead. There's so many, like, smoke effects and whatnot in Galleon Duels and all. Cloud Gaming just abhors it. It gets so framey. So, like, look at that. Look at how framey that gets just trying to look left and right. Also, all the, like, cloud effects and all. 
There were issues with it on the PS2 as well, but it, it just wasn't this bad. Thunder cannon. Got him. Come on. That should be enough. It was. I should be able to land on this pretty easy. Oh yeah, super easy. Barely an inconvenience, I almost screwed it. Hey there, little buddy. Let's make this quick for both of us. Nailed him. Nope. Hey, come over here to you, exploding friend. Thank you. If only I could get... Why doesn't Murray jump over here and do this? He would absolutely dominate. I got hit by my own move and it did a lot of damage. It's fine. We're good. I'm a gamer. I love the little noise. 800! 800 from a single ship and then an extra like 300 on top of it. Or that was almost 400 on top of it. You can get money so fast with galleon duels. I don't want to fight you guys. I'm almost at my uh, location. I hate that I have to go south right now. The game doesn't like going south because the wind is always flowing from the south, apparently. Just a little bit further. Get ready, fellas. We're closing in on the action. I'm prepared. It's a three-on-one battle. You're up for it, Sly. Use some sailing strategy and we'll carry the day. Well, that guy's dead, so that's a pretty good start. This guy's gonna get hit. Also, we'll go. Oh, there's a dude right there. We took it between the eyes. Not between the eyes. Oh, we're gonna get this guy from the back. Is over. Take that. Yeah. Oh, not all of them hit. Dang it. One of them wasn't even up when I shot. It's fine though. We got this. Frames willing. Oh, seriously? I'm gonna be honest. I really thought I just had you there. This isn't going to be fun for either of us. Oh, the other one misses. And you're down. All right, that actually worked out amazingly well for me. Fired a little early because I thought it might be enough. Yeah, so we don't have to board this one. But again, I want the coinage. So we're boarding this one. It's just free money, man. His eyes are broken? Did you see his eyes were not where his eyes were supposed to be? They were beneath his chin? Did you see that or were my eyes playing tricks on me, chat? What the heck? That was horrifying. What kind of nightmare fuel was that? Dude, I swear, cloud gaming makes glitches more likely. I don't ever remember seeing this stuff. Yo, I could juggle him. I should have kept juggling him. Goodbye. Nailed it. I'm a powder monkey! I don't even know what the highest level you can get on this is. Maybe as a kid I got to the highest level, I don't remember. Alright, one more to go. We're back over 3,000 coins already. Why not get some extra money from you? It'll be quick and easy. I really thought I was going to dodge that. Oh, there it is. Oop. That really wasn't enough. Turn us right again, Murray. I mean, starboard. Our matey. Landlubber. Etc. Pirate words. Captain Jack Sparrow. Should probably try to go out of my way for a health pack before we, uh, whatchamacallit. Before whatever it is I'm about to say. Before we fight this next fight, because the next fight I believe we have to beat four ships. Which they always adjust the health to be in your favor, which is nice. Like, the first ship or two will go down really easy, but still. It's four ships. Help. Wrecked. Die, please. Got him. Thanks for the health, loser. Yo, large necklace. Very gold. 762. That's basically, like, that is a, a low-tier, like, a lower mid-tier power-up off of just that ship. 
or at worst, like half of a high tier power up. So much money. I really want some health on my left side before I, there we go, before we do this next red dog fight. It'd be nice if I could get one more, but this, this is enough. That's what I want right there. Please give me this before the fight triggers. Thank you. Little to my left. The right of the ship, but my left on screen. There they are. Yeah, yeah, tough odds. I got it. Don't worry. Where's the... Oh, the fourth one is on the other side of me. Help, help, help. I can't afford to be losing cannons. Alright, one's down. We're back to 1v3. We should be okay. Oh, Murray, turn us a little bit faster. I want to hit this one from the front. Nice, nice, nice. We'll get it with this side. It'll hit us too, probably. Nope, they missed. They're stupid. Goodbye. Nice. Oh, dear. Keep turning. They'll miss. Mm, just barely got us a little bit. It's fine. Is fine. They made a stupid decision turning the way they're turning. Miss. That hit. That's very unlucky that that hit us right there. No, go for the next one. I can't believe that hit. Fire. Thunder cannon. All right, we're good. It's 1v1. We got it. We got it. Not my best uh, pirate play, but it'll work. Man, I want to play Cage 3 again now. I love Pirates of the Caribbean in Cage 3. Might just be my favorite Kingdom Hearts world, period, in any game. At least gameplay-wise. Oh dear, they got a lot of cannons on that side. Turn us faster, Murray. Faster! We gotta line up these shots before they line up theirs. They lose cannons as they take damage too, so yeah, see, it took out a lot of their cannons. Probably also shows how close they are to death. They did that world so good, they really did. Man, I loved Pirates of the Caribbean in Cage 3. That was such a fun world. I want loot. Bum, bum, ba -bum. Excuse me, pardon me, coming through. Hello. Nope. Nope. Ow. Can I juggle you? Oh, nope, that kind of glitched out a little bit. Whoops. I did throw a rock at me. There we go. Ow. Get back. Excuse me, sir. My frames, they're dying. I would like it if you would die instead. He's so alive. No, charge, you idiot. Don't try and hit the downed enemy. There we go. Hey. Look at all this loot, chat. Let's go. That's the last of the Red Sail Sea Dog Clan. With them out of the way, we won't have to worry about a surprise attack or fight impossible odds when we raid Bloodbath Bay. I love how the ship keeps moving while the cutscene dialogue is happening. 69%! Let's go! All right, I'm pretty sure that the world wraps. So if we keep going to the right here, it'll put us on the other side of the map. And then we'll be going straight towards Crusher from the Depths. Which is the last mission, last job that we have to do before the final job of this episode. And I actually really like this job because we get to play as the Panda King again. But I have a lot more fun on this Panda King job than I do the zombie Panda King job. I'm, I'm worrying that the world doesn't actually wrap and it's just gonna keep me at the edge of the map until I turn back around. I thought that it wrapped, but it might not. It does not wrap. If it wrapped, it would have already done it. So we gotta go the long way. 
I feel like every time I play Sly 3, I think that the map wraps, and every single time I'm like, oh wait, no it doesn't, you idiot. Why do you always think that? Probably because like every other video game but Sly 3 wraps a map like this, but Sly 3 is not one of those video games. Look at this water animation. Man, the PlayStation 2 back in like 2005. This is a wild time. 